Karen Clark TK here for Red Carpet Report at the premiere of Steve McQueen's The Man in Le Mans. All right, so tell us why our viewers will love this movie. You know, you have to see it. Uh, your viewers are probably too young to remember when the picture came out, but it's really become a cult classic and one blemish on my dad's career back in 1971. But it turns out this has become such a cult classic. Every I travel all around the world, all different racetracks, and um, every kid that races Formula Ford from 15 up to Alan McNish has won Le Mans three times. They love the reality of the picture. It captures the time. I think the reasons your viewers will like it is there's so many layers to what happened during the making of the picture and it really shows what my dad was all about as far as uh, uh, not really giving a shit what anybody said, including studio ads. So. Did um, making this movie add any elements about your dad that you really didn't know or you discovered while doing this movie? No, no, no. Everything, everything there I knew. Uh, <laughs> I'll tell you what did give me, me goosebumps was that uh, there was an audio where the, the have you seen the picture yet? I have not. Uh, anyways, there's an audio recording of my dad talking that I'd never heard before, and it was just like him talking at the dinner table, you know, and that was nice. But uh, no, there was no surprises as far as what I knew about the picture or my dad. How much do you think uh, race car driving has evolved from then to now? Well. You know, uh, back in uh, in the 60s, early 70s, that's when race car driving was dangerous and sex was safe. Now it's the other way around. That's the way of saying it. Yeah, so I mean, now it's very rare. I mean, we lost Justin Wilson uh, last month, but it's rare that a driver nowadays uh, gets killed. Back then it was just, it was... Um, it was a common occurrence, almost too, way too often, and uh, the speeds that they're reaching at Le Mans now uh, on down the Molson are no higher than they were back in 1969, which was about 240 miles an hour. And there was really no regard to safety back then. They thought there was, but there really wasn't. Yeah. So. Well, thank you so All much, right, and congrats too. on the Special movie. Okay. Thank you. I'll see you around. See ya. Thanks for watching, guys, and don't forget to hit that like button, rate, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what your favorite Steve McQueen movie is.